Hi, I'm Samuel Varghese, and this is Tools for Storytelling. In this episode, we'll be taking a look at the Loha Flexible Tripod. And action. A couple years ago, I was looking for a small, flexible tripod that Rebecca and I could use to vlog our six-week trip to India. I'd seen Casey Neistat talk about liking the convenience of his Joby Gorilla Pod, but he also mentioned its tendency to fall over quite a bit. So I passed on purchasing the Joby, came across the Loha Flexible Tripod, and two years later, I'm still quite happy with that purchase. For starters, we've never had the legs of the Loha give way to the weight of the camera or whatever it happened to be holding. Loha's website says that the tripod can hold up to five pounds, which we actually found to be a rather modest rating of its ability, since we've seen it easily hold uh, 10 pounds of weight. If we are pushing that weight limit, we always make sure the rubber feet have a secure, gripped footing. And of course, since Loha rates the tripod at five pounds, we wouldn't blame them if the legs did give way at weights over that limit. The rubber legs, which are reinforced with what Loha calls a flexible metal, are comfortable to hold, even for extended periods of time, and just have a better ergonomic fit in the hand, opposed to the Joby Gorilla Pod, which kind of feels like a fistful of marbles with a camera on top. Sorry, Joby. The flexible tripod, or flexipod as I like to call it, has a quick release plate that can be clicked into place, and of course a quick release button that can be locked to prevent it from being accidentally released. The quick release plate has a level built into it, which comes in quite handy, and the plate sits on a ball head which provides a pretty comfortable range of motion. The Loha has been in some pretty extreme weather conditions and has always held up. Between the 90% humidity in India and the 100 plus degree temperatures of the Arizona desert, where we happen to live, the Loha has remained reliable. Currently the Loha is selling for about $30 US, while its Joby counterpart is selling for about $50 US. I hope this information has been helpful in your pursuit of tools for storytelling. If it has, please be sure to like and subscribe. And if you know of other flexible tripods that you like, tell us about them in the comments. Thanks for watching.